I don't know if you can see the, oh, hell no. What if this whole thing just came out? <laughs> what's up, y'all? It's your girl, Liza Koshi, and I'm going to reveal what's in my beauty drawer. Singular, not plural, just this one. I began my beauty collection at the young life age of six. I started performing and doing ballet. I had to beat my face, and by beat my face, I mean like acrylic paint and really bright blush for stage makeup, and that made me break out as a kid. So ever since then, I've been trying to find the right beauty secrets and beauty routines, and girl, it's going pretty smoothly if I say so myself, and I did. I have one very humble beauty drawer, and I actually didn't have it before this video series. <laughs> I created a facade, and it also has my line called One of One. So I've updated my face. My face is 2.0. This drawer was so murky, dirty, dusty, musty before. So let me walk you through what I got for you, boo. These are my liners. It's a plug already, come on, Liza. What, I'm proud of what I made, damn. They're called the Think Twice pencils, and you're gonna think twice about how you use them, and let me show you. So it's a double-ended pencil that I'm so excited. I'm trying to like lighten the load of your makeup bag. We already got so much emotional baggage we're carrying around. This is called Auburnin' for you. So I'm just gonna line these not crusty lips. I'm getting them real smooth for someone one day. Let me know if you're there. Cute, right? Yeah, I know. You don't have to tell me. But you can also use this pencil for freckles. I'm a proud mama of my line. That's my favorite thing in my drawer right now. Versatility, baby! Multi-use, baby! I actually have some sage, because we're living in 2020. If you see something, sage something. I got a Palo Santo, I smoke this. Smoke it meaning like you light it on fire and you bring it around your house and you bring in positivity into your world. Then I have, ooh, my retainers. I lost retainers one through eight, so I went ahead and skipped to retainer nine and I put that in one night and I woke up the next morning ooh, with a migraine, but with beautiful teeth. Make up the rules. Here's my lip scrub, my lip mask. This is by Sarah Happ. She is the reason for the not crustacea happening on my lips. This is a sweet clay lip mask. It's a lip scrub, and this is a lip slip. And when I'm done with these, I will recycle them and maybe put a little oregano inside. I'll disinfect that because I have hand sanitizer with that. Here's my oopsie poopsie. Look how little is left. We have a fly swatter. It's multi-purpose. I boiled some water and I cleaned up my toothbrush and it is now my baby hairbrush. My toddler hairs, they're not really tiny, they're pretty long. That is how I get my little swoops in my hair. And my toothbrush actually looks exactly like this and the amount of times that I have brushed my teeth with hairspray is impressive and worrisome. And I have some brushes and I love this company so much. It's called the Crayon Case. It is a black owned business and I'm such a fan of their designs. Look how cute. It's like little pencils. Uh, they're cruelty free too and they're wooden. That's been a recent change in my beauty routine too is like making sure my brushes are cruelty free. Read your labels on the back of your products. Speaking of products, this is something I created. I've always wanted to see it on the shelf and I put it there. Ah! So this is my one of one face mask artist set. It's called Give Em Face. It's the most extra thing in my beauty drawer. This is face off, butter face, resting bee face, and show face. I thought if you can be an artist with your makeup, why can't you be an artist with your mask? I use different masks on different parts of my face every night. Yeah, why are you angry? It's not your face, it's not your life. Let me live mine. Look at that pigment in a mask, huh? Then I have, yo, okay, so I watched so many of these videos that I had to get some drawers and the container store makes me, <laughs> so I bought these drawers right here. Like, I love pulling out, <laughs> let me finish my sentence. I love pulling out these drawers. Oh, shh, cut that part out. This drawer works really well. Like this is, defying gravity. This is all my highlighter, this is my fresh eye pencils. Bomb. I also have my face mask. We're still wearing these, all right? I also have a face mask. I also have a face mask. I also have a face mask and a face mask. Oh, I have more hand sanitizer. The item that I cannot live without is hand sanitizer. I've created an addiction to it. I use it about 10 times an hour. If this year has taught me anything, it's taught me to really clean up. And that is from my routine, to my brushes, to my face, to my uh, lots of parts of my body. These are Sam Wong crayons, and this is what I was creating with in the beginning of the pandemic. And then I created my own. Sam Wong has 
created such a clean, trustworthy line. This is actually my Glossé High Shine Lip Gloss. Look how much peace and joy it's brought me in this moment. A lot of the lip glosses are sticky, and this is smooth, but it has that pop and shine. Speaking of wholesome, use this all the time. A lot of bottles popped this year. Boom, my awake caffeinated chocolate. The quirkiest thing in my drawer would be chocolate. It is caffeinated chocolate, which is my hyper stripper name. Before my beauty drawer was filled with beauty for this video, it was actually filled with food. I love the duality of things. That's chocolate and coffee. Speaking of multi-use, duality. People were like, drop your skincare routine. I was like, nah, I'm gonna drop the F-bomb instead. So this is the, my face balm. That's what the F stands for, calm down. So this is your actual cleanser. And you uncap this side, and it's little silicone bristles. I double cleanse, I exfoliate on Monday, Wednesdays, and Fridays. It's not abrasive, it's not too hard on the skin, and it smells like nothing. Why? Because added fragrances are no bueno for your face. What you put on actually goes in too. Hold on, that's not my dog's hair on it. Bae, come here. This is Phoebe, Phoebe Waller, bitch. <laughs> She's so... <laughs> She has no expression in her eyes, which makes me beg for her love. And then we got, oh, my Biosanchai. This is my Biosan Swollen Oil. It's one of my favorite oils. Also clean, also Jonathan Van Ness. Speaking of clean, this is not. <laughs> I have this wonderful, beautiful product that I refuse to use because I don't want to ever destroy the perfection that is this marvelous Dior. Lip stick. What? Duh, that's making me so nervous it's gonna fall out. Let's get into hair care. This is my pattern water spritzer. It is high tech. That is so smooth. I give a little do and I get my curls back to their natural curl before I slept on it and got bit hit. So this is incredible. Thank you, Tracy. I also have sunscreen. I've been wearing it for the past year and a half because I was not raised to wear sunscreen. You definitely want to wear it every day underneath your makeup. The sun is baking your skin, honey. You're like a cookie underneath the sun, so please wear sunscreen. That's pretty much it. The rest will be left a mystery in case they call me back for a part two. But if you're wondering what this drawer looked like before, it looked like this one. <laughs> this is a hot mess and a wig. Yeah, this was a better year. Yeah, you did. You want to enjoy more? Sure. Click here to watch more videos from Refinery29 and click here to subscribe. Or there. Somewhere. Click it. Bye.